So today, part of my schedule included going on what I think of as a scavenger hunt. I was really excited to see this on my schedule. It says Kids in Micro-G Stowage Collection. And what that means is that I went around and I looked for the list of things that the kids need for me to perform their investigations. So they have had ideas about what they'd like to see, I know, experiments to do up in space, and they've written procedures, exactly how to do those experiments, and my crewmates and I are going to get to find out how well those experiments work and how well we can perform those procedures. And the first step is always to gather the things that you need. So on the list for this round of Kids in Micro-G is some very interesting materials. There are uh, test tubes, tubes that we actually use for urine collection for medical testing. Let's see, there are, I don't want to take them out of here because I'll never get them all back in, but there's pencils. There are empty drink bags, salt and pepper, which you might wonder how we're going to have salt and pepper, who's stay in there, um, salt and pepper up here on the space station, and indeed it is difficult to have regular old salt and pepper. So we have our salt and pepper in little bottles and in liquid form, and that way when I want to add a little salt, I just add a few drops of this white liquid. If I want to add a little pepper, it's this, the drops of this brown liquid right here. It doesn't look very nice, but it sure makes everything taste pretty good. And let's see what else we have. We have binder kit clips, we have shampoo, and we have something I'm pretty fascinated with. We are always very careful about how much space everything takes up um, here in space, because we don't have very much space up here on the space station. And so we are always trying to find a way to make things take up less space. And one of those ways is to think about laundry and our towels and washcloths. So NASA has come up with what we call compressed towels and washcloths. And so these things, these right here, are towels, the big ones, and washcloths, the small ones. And they're really cute. And what happens is we unwrap the plastic, we add water, so the, and then they, then they are wet washcloths and wet towels. And then when they dry out, the towels can be used for drying ourselves and we can use them over and over again. But before we use them, they take up a very small amount of space. And I can't wait to see what the kids are going to do with these on their investigations. So we've got everything in our bag and we are ready for kids in Micro-G.